She's been at it for over two hours. What Safety is she first. even testing? Nothing. Remember that. At this point, she's just doing it for fun. Doctor. Oh, it's you. You're not authorized to be here. I wasn't aware that I needed authorization. <laughs> Father may have given you the keys to the castle, but this is still my laboratory. If you plan to stay down here with us, you need to learn how things work. Is this how you treat everyone? Or are you just putting on the charm for me? Hmm. I wasn't aware that I had to answer to you at all. You're obviously here for a reason, and you've already spoiled my experiment, so you might as well spit it out. I've been sent by the Brotherhood of Steel to find you. You don't beat around the bush, I'll give you that. I knew it was just a matter of time before your people would track me down. I've been looking over my shoulder for almost a decade, waiting for them to send someone like you to kill me. If I wanted to kill you, we wouldn't be talking. That's a fair point. Hmm... Since Father trusts you, I'm going to give you the benefit of the doubt. I might not agree with everything he says, but I know he'd never allow harm to come my way. Say what you came here. You should return to the Brotherhood. Even if I wanted to return to them, why would they want me back? The Brotherhood is having problems, and we need your help. I don't see how that's my problem. Tell me something. Why would I possibly want to come crawling back to the Brotherhood? What reason would I have to throw away everything I've accomplished here? Father trusts me, and so should you. He trusts you because you're family. I'm not. I can't just take your word for it. I need more than that. The Brotherhood has always been straight with you. I am getting a bit tired of all the secrets around here. Sometimes I feel like Father isn't being straight with me. Like there are things I'm not supposed to know about. I don't like that. But still, how can I turn my back on all of this? Your work could be instrumental in freeing the Commonwealth. <sighs> you really know how to push my buttons, don't you? You know, I never understood why the Institute was so damn selfish. All those innocent people up there... dying. And here I am, surrounded by technology that could make their lives better. Yet we hide down here and insulate ourselves from everything and everyone. It's not right. It's not right. I'll make my way back to the Brotherhood. But I'm going to have to do it on my own. I can't take any chances being seen with you. Tell whoever sent you that they've just regained the services of Dr. Madison Lee. Now, for the sake of keeping up appearances, let me see that pit boy of yours. I've been told to install a coarser chip in it for you. Father's orders. You're to be given full access, with the ability to relay in and out of the Institute at will. Thank you. I'm sure that'll come in handy. Given that the relay is the only way to access the Institute, handy is something of an understatement. In case the significance is lost on you, you'll be the only one here with that kind of access. If nothing else, it should demonstrate the amount of trust Father has placed in you. Speaking of, I trust our discussion will remain between the two of us. Now, I need to get back to work, and I'm sure you have other things to do.
No visible reaction to the K-14 compound. We'll start the next trial, then. The dosage will be much larger this time, and the side effects will likely be more pronounced. Will there be any pain? I honestly don't know. I suppose it's your job to find Nothing out. Nothing to report, no, sir. There. All done. You can return to your duties, and remember to record every symptom you experience in detail. I hope I'll prove a useful test subject for you, Doctor. Mm -hmm. You know the protocol, sir. Authorized personnel only. So Dr. Ayo thinks he can hide in his office, does he? Well, you can tell him that I intend to speak to Father about these unannounced security sweeps of yours. Ransacking my quarters in the middle of the night is totally unacceptable. I'll pass along your message, Doctor. See that you do. Hey, Doc. Our new synths are so lifelike, I keep mistaking them for real people. Welcome. Welcome. It is so good to meet you. I truly hope you'll come to think of the Institute as your home. The only place I want to call home was destroyed a long time ago. I'm truly sorry. This must all be terribly difficult for you. You should know that many of us consider it a great honor to have you here. Reporting status. All functions normal. I'm seriously thinking of heading over to robotics to knock some heads together.